That's all. You take this. Ha! Damn you. Ugh. Too slow. Prepare yourself. Be gone. Take this! Gotcha! Yeah! 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 There! Be gone! My sister, all four of the CPUs. We don't have a chance. <gasps> Please stop this! At this rate, Game Industry is doomed. Game industry faces a dire crisis. Shops are boarded up, creators are overworked and starving, and death looms over all game industry men. But the CPUs refuse to let this be game over for their world. Game industry had severed its ties to the chaotic, lawless realm long ago. And yet, ever since the advent of ASIC, the R4 Syndicate of International Crime Morality has all but vanished. As much as 80% of all students are rumored to worship a being known as R4. Parents, despite knowing it to be a poor deity to worship, have gone ahead and allowed their children to do so. Even the governing bodies of the world have turned a blind eye to it, rather than crush the crisis in its infancy. Well, basically, game industry was pretty messed up, you guys. <clears throat> Thus, did game industry fall into complete and utter disarray. Those who tire of living in this corrupt world are sent to wander the game industry graveyard forever lost. Kind of like what IF and Kamba are experiencing right now. Welcome to the game industry graveyard. As its name implies, the game industry graveyard is where those whose time has passed go to rest for eternity. All things you see here were once inhabitants of game industry proper. Uh, oh, really? You know, this is why I said it'd be okay if you stayed behind. N no way! I never agree to that! I want to help Nepnep -Nep and Gigi and the other CPUs as well! And so do I. Hard to believe they've been missing for three whole years now. It's so stupid of them to make me worry like this. All will be made right soon. I am certain they are alive. Even if they are seriously injured, as long as you possess the Sherisite I have prepared for you. Sherisite, the crystallized power of the people's faith. If that's true, then you're right. Okay, let's hurry up and find our ladies, Kampa. We'll carry them all home if we have to. Okie dokie. Jeez, this search is taking forever. Uh-huh. Where do you think everyone could be? Uh, uh... Yikes! Hey, come on! What's with the sudden shouting? Uh, uh, a voice! I heard a moaning voice! You did? Where? What direction did it come from? 
I think it was that way. Nice. Let's get moving. Um, wait a minute. Please don't leave me here alone. There, it's now. Ify? Kampa? Gigi is here too! And look! The other CPUs! How awful! Who would restrain them like this? Would ya? It's no good. She's still out cold. Man, what's up with these stupid tentacle things? Do not attempt to force them free by hand. Kampa, please utilize the Sherisite. Right. It's somewhere here in my handy dandy nurse's pouch. I won't allow it! Ah! Who are you? You better not get in our way. <laughs> For someone to be insane enough to travel here? Inconceivable! Three long years. I've remained idle for too damn long. It's finally time to destroy! I don't get his problem, but we've got a fight on our hands. I'll handle him. So go save the CPUs, Kampa. Y you betcha! Please, please wake up! CPU's up too. <laughs> weak! So pathetically weak! Come on! Make the fight more interesting for me! Come on! Hi, F? Here? <laughs> well, now I feel stupid that you get to see me in such a sorry state. Be careful. This creep is freakishly strong. Let me help out, too. We have to buy some time so everyone can wake up and regain their strength. I... I'll fight, too! Seriously, all the strength you possess? We're not affecting him at all. Kampa, aren't Nep and the others coming too yet? Um, I don't think they're gonna be waking up anytime soon. Perhaps the Sherisite was not pure enough to awaken the CPUs proper. Only... You're serious? Then there's nothing else we can do here. Again going to lose again. No, 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 no! This was just a waste of my time. I'll finish you all off right now! No! I... I'm completely powerless. Wait, if I use what's left of the Sherisite's power, please be enough. <laughs> Come on! My eyes! My eyes! It worked? 
Nice thinking, dear. Was it enough? <sighs> What? What happened? Did she seriously lose consciousness now of all times? Unforgivable. You'll never escape. Once my retinal systems come back online, I'll kill you all! The time has come to withdraw. Nothing more can be done now. You heard her, Kampa. Let's hurry up and get gear out of this place. Y yeah! We managed to lose him. <sighs> Gigi is way heavier than she looks. Even after all that, the only one we could help was Gear. Not to mention, the share site's power was expended, and it shattered when Gigi had it unleash that light. There's no way we can help the CPUs without that. There is no reason to be so hard on yourselves. Saving Nepgear is a very critical accomplishment. Then what's next, Istoir? Return to Planetune. We shall have Nepgear rest until she has recovered her strength. Besides, I must learn what transpired three years ago, even if the memories are painful for her to recall. Anyone should apologize, it should be me. It was my command that sent you five to that battlefield. Huh? N no I would never blame you. It all went south because... because I wasn't strong enough. It may be sudden, but I must ask you to recount what occurred three years ago at the game industry graveyard. Of course. That's insane! All of you lost against a single opponent? That's so hard to believe. How could the CPUs lose? Can I ask a question now? What happened to game industry after we lost that battle? You said it's been three years, so... The situation is bleak, I am afraid. ASIC, under the assumed command of R4, controls much of the world. Disc burning, disc copying, even kids now see piracy as normal and have put their faith in it. In other words, everyone believes in ASIC, so the faith that powers the CPUs has grown very weak. Making just that one small Sherasite crystal took us nearly all three years. Well, with the CPUs absent from their nations, it's no surprise. We failed to save them. And we have come to learn that ASIC's goal is to revive the deity of sin. At the rate our world is declining, they may achieve that goal. But isn't there anything we can do to stop them? Yes, one way yet exists. And that way is you, Nepgear. Along with the other CPU's younger sisters, your fellow CPU candidates. Wait, me? And I'm not the only CPU candidate? Correct. As you know, only the CPUs themselves and the CPU candidates are able to gather shares. If enough shares are recovered, ASIC and those affiliated with it should weaken. They want me to collect shares in my sister's stead? I want to help Neptune. I want to help the world. But there is no way I can beat such a strong opponent. I don't have a chance. Isn't that approach too slow? ASIC might be able to gather shares faster than we can reclaim them. Good point. And even the people who believed in the CPUs probably know they've lost by now. In that case, we could request assistance 
from the mascots that reside in each nation. Like game mascots? Born from the ancient goddesses, they oversee the balance and order of our world in a passive manner. That is to say, they preside over the nations to ensure prosperity and remain neutral to all else. But when needed, they will stand by the CPUs and rid the world of evil's influence. I had no idea they even existed. Indeed. Not even I am aware of their precise locations. I have been researching where the mascot for Planetune resides, but to no avail. I will inform you all once I find something of note. In the meantime, please regain Planetune's shares. This will also serve to rehabilitate Nepgear's combat ability. Makes sense. I mean, Gear didn't even move much in the past three years, let alone fight. Hey, you listening, Gear? Huh? Oh, um, yes. Very well. Then allow me to give you this. What is it? This is the end gear. It is a portable device with a multitude of functions. It should prove invaluable to you. <laughs> 